my great great grandfather that that's his signature i i mean jesus it's, it's right here Oh, that scene from the movie Hitch puts a comedic twist on something that most of us already know. Ellis Island is full of stories. Yes, family stories of the journey through Ellis Island have been passed down for generations. Well, now Cabrini College is asking people to share those stories mm -hmm. for a chance to experience one magical night. Yes, Antoinette Idarola, president of Cabrini College, is here to tell us more. Good morning, Thank Antoinette. Good morning. Here. Very nice and very happy to be here alive. I see you brought some of the students with you today. I look tearing spread out there. It's wonderful. <laughs> and they came. What a big year for it's Cabrini. It's an exciting year. 50th we're, anniversary. we're in our 50th anniversary year. And uh, this exact day, 50 years ago, we admitted 43 students on our campus. And today we opened our doors to almost 3,000 men and women in undergraduate and graduate programs. So it's a great, it's a great year for us. Now you just had a big campaign to raise a lot we of money. just completed a very successful, we went over the top 10,000 hearts uh, uh, campaign. And uh, really over the past decade, we've provided for something like 100 million in projects, uh, new, new buildings and renovation of existing facilities. So wow. it's a great year for us. And I know that you're here to ask our viewers at home to send in their stories, their Ellis Island stories. Talk to me about the Ellis Island Cabrini College connection. Well, obviously, uh, this is a good venue for us to celebrate with St. Francis Xavier Cabrini being the patroness of, of, of immigrants. I think a lot of people have stories to tell. My parents were immigrants from Italy. And I think those stories are moving. So we are encouraging those to please call in and share those stories for us. Is there a chance for people to still be involved in the event coming up in October? Uh, well, it's by invitation only. It's in celebration of our 50th and our gratitude for those who contributed to our 10,000 Hearts campaign. Wow. So. Uh, uh, so it's inv invitation only. And but it's 50 years of celebrating the college. And for you, you're, you're going to be leaving soon. Lori, I'm going to be leaving at the end of this academic year. Mm -hmm. uh, we've done so much. This uh, uh, my successor. Uh, the college is doing a national search uh, now. And my successor will inherit uh, awesome students uh -huh. <laughs> and a superb faculty uh, administrators and staff. If you could come back in 50 years' time when Scabrini is celebrating its 100th anniversary, what would you hope to see? An institution poised to meet the challenges of the future and moving to new levels of institutional excellence. Bill. What will you do? I'm going to rest. <laughs> <laughs> so no, I'm, I'm, I'm open to a lot of different opportunities, yeah. so I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to the next phase of my life. Well, well Antoinette, congratulations, Ida Rola, congratulations. Well, thank you very much. And we will link on our website to your website so people can share those stories about well, Island. I'm really thrilled that we're going to be able to do that. Thank you very much. Thank you, you for being here, for Lauren. bringing such thank a you. great audience. Yeah. We're back with more 10 right after this. This portion of 10, sponsored by Cabrini Cottage's 50th anniversary, do something extraordinary. Tonight.